It's 2021 and being the fair weather paddleboarder that I am, I did not think that I'd be paddleboarding in January. But myself and my good pal Christopher over here, we have decided to sup the River Severn from source to sea. I think the furthest I've ever paddled is 8k in a day. So today we are on my red paddleboard, well Chris's, and I'm on my old, don't even know what brand that is, very bad, very unstable paddleboard. But luckily for us, Red Paddle Co is supporting us and we're gonna be getting two Voyager boards. But today it's all about getting Chris on a paddleboard, seeing if he can do it and if he doesn't abscond and go for an alternative or inflatable. You wanna stop, pump it up. You got to pump it up. You wanna stop, pump it up. You got to pump it up. Hopefully we don't fall in. Cause how warm is it today? I'd say, I don't know, four or five degrees. Four or five degrees. That's at least 20 degrees colder than I normally have. Always put your leg strap on. Transfer that weight. Are you a bit stressed? This is it, right? Yeah, I'm done. All right. And it's See just... Go. Wait for me! Sound advice, down my burning loins. <laughs> so my toes are like actual ice. And I think it's because I've got waterproof socks on as well as my neoprene boots. So I think that the neoprene isn't doing its warming job. <laughs> my feet, lovely and dry on this board. This one on the other hand. Yeah, you're welcome. You've got my sexy Sac red board. Sacrificing. Nice and, nice and stable, don't get your feet wet. And I'm on this old Groupon number. <laughs> <laughs> I did. That's how I first got into powder warning. I'm going to buy one, A bargain. one free on Groupon. All right, well, tune in next time to see how Ellie gets on <laughs> with her feet. Fascinating vlogging. We're just getting to our first lock. So this is our first ever Portage. Or should we, um, should I stay on, you get out, open the lock and the sluice gates and... Um... Oh yeah, we're just going to open the yeah. lock for a couple of paddle boards. <laughs> Don't try it. Don't try it. Sit down. Oh my god, it's stressing me out. Part of me wants you to fall in, but another part of me doesn't, because if you fall in, you won't want to do this trip with me. <laughs> this is fucking cold. Oh my god. I'm getting closer and closer to the edge. <laughs> Graceful! Smooth! Woo! We've paddled 5k in an hour and a half, is it? Almost, yeah. Almost. Round, about, round about an hour and a half. My feet are frozen, so we've had to have a little riverside stop while I warm my feet up. And uh, Christopher has bought his jet boil and some little camp meals. So we're about to have, well, he's having a chicken curry and I'm having spag bowl. Just use river water for this? Yeah. Job's a good one. Lovely, lovely. Camping spork, necessary uh, confinement for all suppers. <laughs> all suppers, get it? Supper. Hey! Smells <laughs> good. Not bad. Pretty good. We've worked out that in order to cover what we want, which is like a marathon, <laughs> each day it's going to take us like 12 13 hours of paddleboarding <laughs> there you go <laughs> that's the task oh no some right. water's dribbled into my boot oh fresh clean cold water we are still paddling <laughs> <laughs> That's going to be all the updates. Still paddling. <laughs> I've paused paddling to put my hands in the armpits. Very important part of winter kayaking. Gloves. Tell you what though, my feet, still freezing. So uh, pretty much done it. Smash it. Easy. 
10K. Let's just, you know, do that times 20. Done. <laughs> Easy. <laughs> right? Yeah. Easy. <laughs>